It's called higher fares. I mean, I, <laughs> bottom line of the whole thing. We have the best airport system in the world. Real issue here is our air traffic control system has fallen behind, fallen behind, fallen behind. And unfortunately, airlines and the consumer are going to have to adjust for that with less capacity out there. And that's all across the country. So it's going to be fewer seats, but it is going to affect the entire nation because we just haven't invested as we should have over the years. Now, I've talked to a couple of airline CEOs over the past couple of weeks, and you know, there's some uh, optimism about what's going to happen in the future, but they know it's very uncertain. Leisure air travel has somehow has moved up the food chain of needs from where it was 10 years ago, five years ago, where you know that trip to Florida, that trip to Phoenix is far more of an important event than it was before. So it's a strong market, but again, when you have to cut back on capacity, that means what capacity is left is going to cost you more.